The manner in which the tyrants of Rome kept the people of Rome, the plebeians, the slaves, the way they kept them happy and content at some level was bread and circuses. I've been to the Flavian Amphitheater, okay? We call it the Colosseum. I've been there many times in Rome. It's wonderful, just amazing. It's owned by the church. It is a church, by the way. Christians' blood were shed there. Martyrs died there. Untold number of gladiators died there. The games were, were pretty brutal, but they were all free. Did you know that? Did you know that? They were all free. Because it was the way that people could sit in the stands and scream and cheer and have something to talk about. Bread and circuses. As long as the people had bread and circuses, they weren't going to have an uprising. And the bread and circus trick has, has been a key part of America's demise. I'm genuinely concerned for the sake and the future of our country. I am. I'm, I'm concerned for my children. We are in trouble and it's getting worse. And people look at someone like Ted Cruz, an outsider, a strong Christian man, Donald Trump, a forceful character. He and they and they and these men make promises that they are going to turn things around. Those of us who are paying attention are anxious for someone to turn it around. We don't know what's going to happen, but friends, I'm, I'm, my advice to you is this. This pray. is what I'm going to tell you. Pray like it all depends upon God and fight and work like it all depends upon you. Ora e labora, pray and work.